Let's talk about the last one, which is the biosphere, and probably the most important. We spoke about lithosphere, which is, let's say, the soil part where we build our houses. And we have the mountains. We spoke about the hydrosphere, where we have the rivers, right? In this portion, you may have trees as well. Then we spoke about the atmosphere, which is the air which concerns, covers, and is on top of all these things. But there are some parts of Earth where all these three come together. Part of Earth where all the three come together. And this is where life exists life when we talk about ourselves, life when we talk about the animals, life when we talk about other living, other living organisms, right? So this combination of three which makes life possible is what is known as the biosphere. And you know, it's, it's very interesting that change in any of these three, which is the atmosphere, right, which is the hydrosphere or the lithosphere causes change in the entire biosphere. So let's say for example, if you cut down all these trees, what will happen is the soil becomes loosened and as winds comes, this moves away. When the water flows increases, we see that some portion of land are washed away. So let's say for example, when the tsunami came, part of land actually got submerged into water. Right? So changes in either of these three can actually bring about changes in the entire biosphere. To be very simple, biosphere is a combination of atmosphere, hydrosphere, and lithosphere which makes life possible. Thank you for being with us today.